Okay, today, a uh, quick two minutes on what peel ply is in G10. If you've used peel ply and know what it is, this video isn't for you. If you've never seen it, give me two minutes and I'll show you what it's about. Peel ply is a G10 product that comes when it's made it has a plastic liner on top of it now I've peeled back some of this and in this plastic that's on top it's got a texture and it leaves a pattern a texture in the resulting G10 so if I peel this off I'll have a textured G10 now this one happens to be medium and there is a course that will have a more aggressive texture and a thicker piece of plastic. Now that's all great um, when you're using it. Uh, getting it off is a challenge. To peel this off, you, you have to get this little plastic layer off and peel that material off. And you end up with a piece of scrap thrown away and that's uh, exposed, that texture. Now in practice, when you're using this material, generally you leave uh, the plastic on until one of the final steps and then you peel it off and you get a nice look if you uh, do that earlier uh, you may scratch up some of the texture or get a bunch of dirt in there if it gets dirty and that you can blow it out or wash it out and that'll clean up some of that texture getting the peel ply off can be a real challenge sometimes uh, it's easier on a corner sometimes you can just get your fingernail up under there and peel that back and get that started just like this. This is OD Green. I was able to get under there and I'd take pliers and peel that back that way. The hard part is when you're on a finished uh, blade like this, or liner, or scale rather, and um, now I've rounded this off since I peeled that off because the edges get quite sharp when you're uh, profiling that out. So in this one I would start the sharpest corner there and just get under that plastic and start getting it back just peeled enough and sometimes it comes off in 30 seconds and sometimes it takes minutes and minutes and it's frustrating and you're cussing and bleeding all over because you cut yourself with one of these be careful now on the curve again you've got all that pressure holding it down there and the sharper the corner they're less um, reluctant it is to come up. So if I peel it from that corner it's going to be pretty easy. But if I get under here it's going to be tough. So it'll come off. It seems like it won't. You can actually see the pattern in there. Uh, there's coarse and there's medium in a few different colors. Now we stock a few thicknesses. We've got an OD green in one thickness, orange in a couple thicknesses, and black uh, in a couple thicknesses also. And then uh, we'll have a medium and a coarse and you can maybe see the difference right here this is a coarse texture a lot more aggressive uh, the plastics easier to peel off sometimes this is a medium texture and it's arbitrary I don't know how it's measured or anything it's just how we have it made but that's the deal with peel ply it gives you a great grippy surface and it comes in different textures coarse medium you might even see a fine out there and in some colors really adds a nice grip nice look uh, almost a finished production look to your piece and uh, give it a try and see how you like it thanks for what uh, shopping with us at usa knife maker appreciate your business see you on knife dogs that's it